Hi guys, welcome to the Fight Age channel. British heavyweight veteran David Price believes that his competitor Dylan White is capable of causing problems to the current WQBC world champion Tyson Fury. As we all know, White lives his life, trains like a beast, goes out and throws the fight. Here he is an underdog, but now without chances. In my opinion, White has one of the best left hooks in the heavyweight division. The way he throws out the left hook, it feels like Julian is hitting with the baton. White has a big arm span, really long guards. I know that Fury has the longest arms in the heavyweight division, but Julian probably compensates for his small height with a swing of his arms. Besides, he has a solid jab. Say David Price. The British heavyweight contender Daniel Dubois spoke about the upcoming championship match of Division neighbors and competitors Tyson Fury and Dillian White. According to Dubois, White has a chance of an upset, despite a disappointing pre match loss for him. Fury is the best heavyweight in the world right now, but Dillian cannot be right enough. Everything happens in a boxing, so he has a chance. But yes, Fury stands apart now. We are waiting for a good fight. The fights are said in an interview. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my channel. I'm trying very hard, absolutely every day, and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks to everyone who subscribes to my channel, you are my support. Thank you so much. Former world champion in two weight categories Ricky Hutton believes that Dylan White will do everything possible to defeat WBC World Heavyweight Champion Tyson Fury. According to Hutton, Dylan has waited too long for his opportunity and will try not to miss it. Dylan boxed in front of a big crowd, but this will be the most massive fight of his career. Still, I don't think it will embarrass him because he is a determined person. White has been the main contender for the championship title for a long time. For almost three years, he is still waiting, stays in the gym and is hungry. All this shows that he is a very determined fighter. Dylan has been waiting forever to get a title fight. Now it's happening. I don't think all this has any effect on his nervous system. Also, I don't know, he will be embraced in front of such a large crowd. Dylan will not break down and will fight to the end, Hutton said. The world heavyweight boxing champion Britain Tyson Fury expressed his opinion about competitor Dylan White. If we brought sad from the merits and titles won, what did he actually win? He has already won the title of British champion, but it is the maximum. He won some sort of the interim WBC title, or whatever is it. But it's not a real title. This is not an official belt. It doesn't matter. WBC silver is like a Mickey Mouse belt. I hope the WBC doesn't mind me saying that. But it's not a world title. Mauricio would have said so himself. It's not a world title. This is a stepping stone belt for a young fighter who is racing, Fury said. Ronnie Shields, coach of WBC middleweight champion Jermal Charlo, discussed the upcoming rematch of WBA, WBO and IBF heavyweight title holder Alexander Usyk with Anthony Joshua. AJ and I were just talking about what I thought he should have done, that he needed to work on it a little bit. Our conversation was about this. I think their second fight will be good. The first match turned out to be good and both guys will have to make adjustments. I think Joshua is capable of winning by a judicial decision. Look, AJ is a strong guy, and he really knows how to fight. But it all depends on the idiots he makes in the ring. Naturally, he can't fight like he did in the last fight, so he needs to change everything. If Joshua can't change, it will mean that Uzik needs to change, Ruin Shield said in an interview. Ex-world champion Tori Bielli is confident that the rematch of the WBA, WBO at IBF heavyweight title holder Alexander Usyk with Anthony Joshua will be interesting. Ok, it's Saudi Arabia, July. Let's just wait and see what condition Alexander is in, if he prepares well for the fight, and Joshua is doing well. Then we will talk more about this fight later. But it's an interesting fight, it really is, Bielli said. Thanks for watching guys, if you like this video please subscribe to my channel.